September morning. It's a very sunny September morning and I'm surrounded by chickens. We've let them out for a little bock about the garden whilst we give their coop and their run. A bit of an overdue clean and tidy actually. It's been a couple of weeks. I'm also going to do a bit of sort of autumn maintenance of the garden this morning. It's Sunday. It's going to be a bit of an autumnal Sunday today. I'm going to make a lovely autumnal sausage casserole later and I'll show you how I do that. And some apple crumble. Might take down the summer bunting as well. Open up the window. I'm breathing in the last of September. I can feel the wind blow. You have to mix in some honey first. And the late sun skies like a dying ember. Everything is turning into gold. When the autumn leaves are playing chasing, puts a smile up on my face. We've got loads of tomatoes still on our tomato plants. Some are green and some are red, but they're not growing. And the ones that are green are not ripening. So I'm going to collect them all in here. There's loads to do something with. Not sure what yet. Probably spicy green uh, tomato ketchup, which is what I made last year. I'll pop the link to the recipe in the description box underneath. And if I do make it, I'll show you in Vlogtober, which starts next week. This week, Saturday. <laughs> Love you. Good luck, Bye. Save lots of goals. get changed so I started but I haven't finished hacking back a very overgrown salvia and that was quite hot work even on quite a cool day so I've had to come in and get changed I've also left it because I was getting a bit tired it's hard work using the giant scissor things I'm just getting some apples ready I picked these ages ago at my stepmum's uh, it was the first weekend in September actually and today is the Oh, why is my watch doing something funny? That's quite cool. It's not what it's supposed to do though. Look at that. It's supposed to tell me what the date is. Oh. I think it might be the 25th of September today. So it's been quite some time since I picked them uh, from her apple tree, but they're all still great. And I'm just and I've also been given some apples by a friend of mine uh, just down the road. Her neighbour. <laughs> had a load of apples that they were giving away and she couldn't use them all so she gave some to me so I've got lots of apples to make apple crumble later such a lovely autumnal thing to do so I will share my very 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 simple recipe for apple crumble 
Dan has taken Phoebe to her football match. She's now playing in matches on Sunday, so he's taken and he helps with the team, the girls' team. So he's he's gone to do that. Lilia is at a sleepover at one of her friends' houses. I'm gonna go and pick her up in about half an hour. So I'm very quickly going to have some lunch. And when I get back, I'm going to make the sausage casserole for later. I think my mum's gonna come for dinner. Uh, so I'm gonna get stuck into doing all of that and make apple crumble and just generally have a bit of an autumn cook up this afternoon. The garden and the chickens are all lovely and clean. I haven't finished tidying it entirely ready for winter, but I've done a lot. Dan's got to cut the grass and it's funny when you work on the garden even though it's not finished I know I've done a load of work, work out there and it's a lot tidier and the house is a mess and really needs a load of sorting out but everything feels that little bit tidier just because I've cleaned the garden out a bit. <laughs> it's like when you clean a drawer nobody knows you've cleaned out a drawer and it's nice and tidy but you feel more organised and that the house is more organised because of that one drawer. I love cleaning out drawers. Right lunch. I washed the bunting and it's come out really well however in the spin it's fair to say it's become rather knotted. Fortunately I really like unknotting things but this might take me some time. Hmm. So here is my sausage casserole recipe. I will write it out in the description box below. It was originally for a vegetarian casserole using meat-free meatballs. And then I converted it so we used vegetarian sausages. And now I'm gonna use normal sausages because, big news, after three and a half years, Phoebe suddenly decided to make a return to eating meat, which is, completely fine by us and it coincided with quite a large growth spurt and a huge appetite so it could just be her body is telling her what she needs at the moment. So we're going to have Cumberland sausages with this and I'll put it all on the screen and I'll write out the recipe underneath. Hello! Oh hello!
So in my excitement to serve up the dinner, because we were all so hungry, I forgot to actually film serving up the dinner. So here is the short Here one. is a montage of me now. <laughs> Ooh, I mean, that doesn't make it look appetising, but it really oh, delicious. Hang on, what about from, this? From, from Oliver Twist. Lydia, you have something to say. Oh, I got a job. <laughs> Working for who? Lush. And you're happy? And what's your discount? 50%. Wow. Then we are all happy. You're happy. You're happy? I am. Turn the world around us into gold. When the autumn leaves are playing, chasing, puts a smile up on my face. They leave their branches one by one. Through the last days of September